Hello, my name is Ana Rivera. Today I'm speaking to you about our medical lab technician program. This is an Associates of Applied Science program located at the West Campus. Your program director is Ami Rosales, and I am your program advisor. Please take note of our contact information as we're happy to answer any questions you may have after listening to today's information session. I'm often asked, what can I do with this degree? Medical lab technicians play a vital role in the effective diagnosis and treatment of patients. You're expected to collect samples and perform tests to support doctors and other medical professionals as they detect diseases and treat patients. A career as a lab tech can be rewarding and meaningful because you get to help physicians and surgeons determine a patient's diagnosis. It can be an exciting challenge for anyone who enjoys solving problems. Clinical lab techs are trained to act as investigators, find clues, and uncover answers that can help patients receive better diagnosis and treatment. Medical lab technicians work behind the scenes on important research for advancement in the medical field to help others. Few other careers let you work within the medical community this way. Laboratory work is very hands-on, so no day is ever boring. The national average salary is about $60,000, with Arizona sitting just below that at about $57,000. We're very proud to say that 100% of the students completing Pima's MLT program are either hired as medical lab technicians or in a related field, or choose to continue their education. Each semester, both fall and spring, we clear about eight students to enter the MLT program. This is a five semester program with 63 semester credits overall. Students must complete all general ed requirements. These are your non-MLT classes prior to being cleared to take those MLT courses themselves. The approximate costs overall are about $7,500. Now, depending on where your clinical assignment is, these additional costs can range between $500 and $2,000. The good news is it is a financial aid eligible program. The admissions process. This is where we start choosing your classes to enter the program. Chemistry 151, Math 151, and the Occupation score of 265 is required to apply to the program. Now, something to keep in mind are there may be prerequisites to these initial classes. For example, Chem 151 has a prerequisite of Math 151. So it does matter what order you take them in and where you place in your assessment exams. So that's where you come see me and we can look at your assessment exams, any possible transfer work you may have, and we can start building a class plan. Program prerequisites must be completed before you're accepted into the program. However, we do encourage you to apply to the program early on. We do like to plan our student cohorts in advance. So if you are thinking about applying to the program and you still have some courses to take, those initial ones, go ahead and come see me. We can fill out an application to get you started and holding the slot in a future cohort. Then we can start working on making sure all your prerequisites are met. You want to take a look at that application? This is the website where you can go to see that in full. You do need to have all those classes completed before you actually start the MLT classes. You do need to make sure your assessment tests are, are completed. That's your math, your reading, and your writing. That way we know we're placing you into the correct classes. If you do have transfer work from somewhere else, you want to make sure that you've sent the official transcripts to Pima College to the registrar's office for an official evaluation. That way when you come see me, I will take your assessment exams, I will take your transfer credits, and we can make sure we're placing you into the right classes. Other requirements for the application, and these are fully listed on the application themselves, are vaccination exams, fingerprints, toxicology, other things like that. 
and you'll see the complete list on that application. It can take some time to get those completed, so make sure you come see me so we can go over that prior to your anticipated start date. And the MLT classes themselves, they last about five semesters, with your initial semester being your gen ed requirements before you begin the MLT coursework itself. I'm going to show you an example here of those program requirements. So that first semester is going to be your gen eds, your communication classes, your arts and humanities, social behavioral sciences, and you may even have some of these classes already. Then once you're completed with these gen eds, that's when you can really dig into those MLT classes. And they can be quite intense, so we want to make sure that you're prepared and your outside um, responsibilities are minimized as much as possible so you can concentrate on the MLT program. Now, getting ready to get started. Review the admissions requirements. That's the ones we went over today. Make sure you familiar yourself with the handbook and the application itself. All those necessary tests, the assessments, and the paperwork need to be completed. And then come see me and we can make sure you have that all the packet is complete. Now, if you're brand new to Pima, you're going to want to see your enrollment advisor first. That is so they can help you finish your application for Pima College itself, get your new student checklist completed, your assessment exams, all of that taken care of before you come see me, your program advisor. And if you're a continuing student or a transfer student, you can come see me directly and we can make sure that you have all your transfer credits, your assessment exams are finished, and we can make sure you have a course plan set before you. This is my email address of where you can reach me, or you can also use this QR code to make an appointment with either an enrollment advisor or with myself. Thank you for your interest in Pima's MLT program. We are here to help. So please reach out for guidance and support. I look forward to working with you.